Buzz wished she had never read the professor's words. The words thumped like her beating heart as she raced over the forest floor. Bees can't fly! Bees can't fly! Bees can't fly! I must warn Owl! I must warn Owl! I must warn Owl! The more she thought of Old Owl, the less she thought of the professor's words. Until, suddenly... Milkweeds were below her, and the firelight was warm on the buzzing blur of her wings. She was flying! She darted into Old Owl's nest. Smoke billowed and made her drowsy. She settled woozily by her friend and buzzed as loud as she could. She held that note until she toppled into Old Owl's ear. Old Owl awoke with a start. Fire, he cried, and swooped from the nest. He perched in the hollow of a nearby maple tree and waited. Luckily, it soon began to rain. Later, when it stopped, Old Owl shook his damp feathers. Then he sneezed. Out from his ear popped Buzz. Buzz, said Old Owl, what are you doing in my ear? <laughs> I think I saved you, said Buzz. And I can fly. Of course you can fly, said Old Owl. You're a bee. Bees fly. Yes, said Buzz, you're right. I'm a bee. I can fly! Aerodynamically speaking, the bumblebee should not be able to fly. But the bumblebee doesn't know it, so it goes on flying anyway. <laughs> 